Good morning. Let me introduce Professor Hide Taka, Takawayashi. Uh, what are the main topics of your talk during this workshop? My topic is presbyphagia, sarcopenic dysphagia, and swallowing rehabilitation. And presbyphagia is age-related swallowing muscle, ch swallowing function change. It's not dysphagia. And sarcopenic dysphagia is a dysphagia caused by sarcopenia of generalized skeletal muscles and swallowing muscles. And swallowing rehabilitation includes dysphagia rehabilitation and nutrition improvement in rehabilitation. Could you explain, explain us the characteristics of your research in these patients? Uh, in my research, uh, I study the relationship between head lift strength. It can reflect suprahyoid muscle strength and dysphagia and malnutrition. The result is head lifting strength is independently associated with dysphagia and malnutrition. That indicates that there are some relationship between sarcopenia of swallowing muscles, dysphagia, and malnutrition. Why dysphagia care is so important in Japan? Because there are f huge number of dysphagia patients, especially aspiration pneumonia is a very, very important topic. A lot of patients are suffered from aspiration pneumonia because aging society is very in developing. Do you have any specific guideline to manage this patient and to avoid patients with aspiration pneumonia? Uh, to tre treatment of guidelines, there is some guideline for pneumonia, but prevent, I suppose there is no guideline for prevent aspiration pneumonia. Mm -hmm. But uh, I can say oral health care. I think it's a very, very important, important topic, yes, yeah. Yes, I think yes, you are yes, also sir. very well developed <laughs> considering <laughs> oral health a relevant factor in yes, the yes. pathophysiology of aspiration pneumonia. Yes, the dentist and dental hygienist is mm, trying to clean or clean the oral function or structure. 